Yo, what's good, fam? My name is Fresh Change, and today we are reacting to Sword Art Online Alicization Episode 3. Before I get into this shit, all the people who don't care about what the fuck I have to say, here's a thing so you can skip forward in the shit. You're welcome. For everyone who does care about what I have to say, thank you. How are you guys doing today? I hope you're having a, a swell, a, an astounding day. I can't think of the words I want to use. I'm tired. I've been losing. I've, I've been missing out on sleep lately. I'm sorry. But yeah, before this shit starts, I just want to let you guys know that there will be a lot of cuts in it. You will only see the parts where I'm going to be talking in because I don't want to get copyrighted. The first episode I tried to put up, they blocked my shit three times before I finally got it up the fourth time and you guys could watch it and shit. So I'm not going to risk that shit happening again. So I'm only leaving the parts where I'm talking in it and you will be seeing like parts where the video was like blurred and shit. What's good fam? Sorry to interrupt my own video, but I just want to let you guys know that I talked for like another two or three minutes straight and I know y'all don't want to hear that shit. So I'm just here to say, let's get into this shit fam. In the hills, fucking superstars, feeling like a pop star. Drinking any bad bitches, jumping in the pool and I ain't got on no bra. this shit really starts i just want to let you niggas know that um <clears throat> first of all i like to eat when i watch shit and i like to watch shit while i eat so don't fucking judge me second of all if you were the people that skipped forward i just want to remind you guys that um you know i'm editing a lot of this shit out you're only gonna see the parts where i'm talking because i don't want to get fucking copyrighted what the fuck i'm about to say what the fuck okay is this alice or what because she looks just like her all right this episode is called the end mountains okay so her name is selka okay Oh, that's her sister. No wonder. So the scary don't get a fight in this episode? That'd be dope as fuck. Like, that shit would just make my day. Okay, so the Axiom Church are the people who wrote the Taboo Index. Okay. So we're actually learning shit in this episode. That's what's up. That's what I want. That's what I wanted out of this. Oh, shoot. That's the sword. That's the sword from the first episode. I don't even have to see it. I just know it is. Well, yeah, Kirito like a heavy sword. So is Kirito like removed from Yujiro's memories? Because it didn't show him in the flashback just then okay so after alice got taken away yuji went back to the cave to get the sword okay so there's divine objects in this world made by like gods and shit okay so that's cool bro if he take down this fucking tree i'm a spice bro that shit glowing oh what the fuck okay so i only went down by one because you didn't cut into the cut that was already made he just hit the outside okay i feel like yuji are gonna be able to cut it down don't fucking tell me bro oh i was about to say did he even cut into the cut that was already made or did he just hit the outside of it but that shit look relaxing as hell i want a hot tub bro damn oh shit she's gonna go to the end mountains so if she goes she probably thinks that she's gonna get taken away just like alice and they're probably gonna take her to the same place because i'm pretty sure they didn't kill alice they probably got her i don't know fucking trapped somewhere or something oh yeah because she made the things like up in the first episode so that's what he did nigga this dumbass yelling bro why you don't have any weapons bro you better find a sword or some shit in there they speak english what the fuck so you're gonna blow y'all cover and then not move don't tell me that's fucking it don't tell me that's it so like they just going in the episode like that every fucking time right cliffhanger at the end of every fucking episode I mean, it's smart for them to do that because, you know, it'll make you want to watch the next episode. But at the same time, that shit fucking pisses me off, bro. Like, damn, I want to see these niggas fight. I got to wait seven more days just to see what the fuck they going to do. Man, but this was a good episode, though. We did learn a few things in this episode. Unlike the last episode, we really didn't learn that much. We did learn that the tree was called the demon tree in the last episode. But in this episode, we actually learned like way more. And it turns out the Axiom Church, they made the taboo index and shit. You know, gods be making divine objects in, in the world and all that. I didn't know that Selka was Alice's sister. I didn't know that Alice really had a sister. I was just like, who the fuck is this? I just thought it was somebody that looked very similar to her. Then after we figured out that, you know, Alice had a sister, we knew her name and shit. And then we found out that she didn't know why Alice was taken. Then when she did figure out why, we figured out why no one told her how she was taking a how she was taken away. Because if she had known, she would have did exactly what she did, which was go all the way the fuck out there. I called the shit too. I was like, okay, you probably shouldn't have told her how she got taken away. She was like, oh, the in mountains, huh? Okay. As soon as she was like, 
hmm, the end mountain. Soon as she thought that shit, I was like, she's gonna fucking go there, isn't she? I, I, I knew she was. I knew she was fucking going there. Then Yu-Gi-Oh, this dude need to grow some balls, bro. Cause like this nigga, every every time some shit go down, he just freeze and don't do nothing. I mean, I understand the first time the little cold shit popped up in his eye, and that prevented him from moving. I get. I'm just gonna assume because he didn't do shit. But this time, nothing even popped up in his eye. Nothing stopped him from doing anything. First, he yells loudly to just blow they fucking cover. And then when they finally get seen and shit, he's like, you know what? Let me just freeze in place and not do anything. But I feel like they're gonna end up finding like weapons in the next episode, like at the beginning or some shit. They're probably gonna be like, okay, well, a lot of people came up in here and niggas died and shit. So, yep, their weapons are just all over the ground and whatnot. So, I feel like they're gonna just, like, pick up some swords or something and start whooping their ass. Like, especially Kirito. I feel like he's gonna do that shit. I don't know what the fuck Yu-Gi-Oh! is gonna do because that nigga dude don't want to fucking stand up for nobody or even himself. Like, damn, bro. Yep, next episode drops... Saturday, I, th I I don't fucking know. When the next episode drops, I'm definitely gonna be doing a reaction to that one. Let me know if you guys want me to react to Goblin Slayer though, because I did think about it as soon as I heard about the anime, but then I was like, mm, I think it's only like two or three episodes out right now. But still, there's only three episodes of this out right now, so I guess it wouldn't hurt to do that shit. So yeah, if you guys want me to react to that, comment that shit down below. If it's anything else you guys want me to react to, comment that down below as well. Let me know what you guys think about this episode, what you guys think about me doing reactions to this and, and, and shit. Um, but yeah, I'm out of this bitch. Thumbs up, peace. It's sir! <laughs>